Tonight, surgeons in Winter Park are offering the only head and neck robotic surgery in Central Florida. This machine can do it all, from clamping to cutting to stitching. It helps doctors remove tumors faster with much less pain for patients. That's right. Local 6's morning anchor Bridget Williams takes us to the operating room with more on how this new technology works. Head and neck cancers usually require major surgeries with large incisions and long recoveries. But now, thanks to robotic surgery, patients have an option that's less invasive, requiring no incisions, no broken bones, and quicker recovery. It's almost like having a virtual presence down there, having a min miniature version of yourself right there, being able to see things right up close and manipulate the tissues directly. Small scopes and tools give surgeons like Dr. Jeffrey Lehman the freedom to move through and see areas they normally normally couldn't without invasive surgery. He runs the tools with these small hand controls and a powerful microscope. And the pain just got worse and worse where I was taking, you know, headache medicine every day just for the pain that went from my ear all the way to my neck. Gina Harmon needed surgery that traditionally would have meant slicing her lip and jaw open in several places, plus 10 days in the hospital afterward. But Dr. Lehman was able to use the robot to cut out her cancer instead, which meant a faster, less painful recovery. I could have probably gone back to work after one week. I did not feel too much pain to be at work. I was up walking around. I even went to a restaurant one week afterward. The robot is so effective, doctors say cancer patients need less care in the long run as well. We can many times save patients uh, additional radiation therapy afterwards. These are the tiny tools that go onto the end of the robotic arms. And if you think these are small, in the next couple of years, even tinier technology will be available to surgeons to help them get into those hard to reach places. I'm Bridget Williams, and I'll see you on the morning news starting at 5 a.m. Robotic surgery is also gaining popularity as a treatment for prostate cancer and heart problems.